Yeah, Kristen, you know, we're going to take advantage of the weather while we can. Earth Day is tomorrow, and although the weather sounds like it could be a gloomy day, at least part of it, we can still get our workout in. So joining me right now is Jeshua Bunton. He is a Planet Fitness personal trainer. Good to mm -hmm. see you, Jeshua. Nice to see you, too. So I really do like this idea of getting outside, enjoying nature, and then getting physically fit at the same time. Yeah, it's just a little bit like a different way of putting your energy back into the earth and doing something good for yourself. Oh, I love the way you put that. So yeah. poetic. Yeah. So what are some of the things we can do if we go outside under the trees to get in shape? So one of the easiest things you can do is simply, it's called a good morning. Mm. All you're gonna do is just lock your feet in and just bend back till you feel a stretch in the hamstrings and then go down just a little bit further to work that okay. lower back as well. Ah. And it's just one of the things, everyone has lower back problems. I do, I everybody totally, has that. everybody does? Everybody has that, okay, all the time. I don't feel so yeah, bad. no, everybody has that. They have something wrong, lower back's okay. hurting. And so oh. just working that, just getting that flexion down there and come back up with your body weight, help you just adjust to that a little bit. How does that help the lower back? Because it just builds the muscle? Yeah, right there, very at the bottom is called the erector spinae and that's just where, mm. that's what that does. Flexion and extension and just help putting that at a load, but it's just body weight. So it's not super heavy huh. and you don't want to push too far, but you just come bring yourself back up. Okay, that is good to know. Yeah. We could do that at the park this weekend. Yeah, anytime. Okay, now, what's another one? Another one is just a simple body weight squat. And with a squat, you just want your feet about shoulder width apart mm -hmm. and you want to just make sure your hips drop back. Okay. I like to keep my hands out in front so it keeps my chest upright because okay. another thing is you don't want to come too far because then you're going to start to, if you have oh. any weight or anything, that's where that lower back, could, that impingement, that's why you do a good morning like with no weight. You just Go work on that like flexion. This. But on a squat, you want to keep your chest upright. Down. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Straight down. Is that problematic for the knees? Um, it can be if you have some knee issues. So what you do is you just go down as low as you can until you okay. hit that pain point or yeah. tension point and then just work on working that ligament a little bit more so it gets stronger so you can keep dropping lower. Okay, what do you do with your hands while you do this? I go into so I, 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 like, I like to do this. I dream a genie. Right yeah, no, I, that's exactly it. what I do. I like to do that right there. <laughs> or I'll hold it like across my chest like okay. this. Okay, yeah. good deal, good yeah. deal. Um, All right, what's next, Joshua? So another one is a soil to sun burpee. I know this like is a little bit... A lot, like it's a good um, calorie burner, but it's a great workout. So all you're gonna do is just start in a good stance, okay. drop down, uh -huh. kick out, then come down and point back up to the sun. It's just another way to get more Earth Day involved with your workout, and it's gonna get you a good sweat going, and mm -hmm. it'll be a very quality workout. And that's good for basically the whole, whole body. body. Whole body, whole yeah. body, because you're jumping back up with your legs, but you're also pushing down with your arms, like a push-up mm -hmm. type of thing, and so it's just a full body workout. Okay, I'm gonna skip yeah. that one for now. Yeah. <laughs> but you say that for sure, we can enjoy the outdoors over the weekend or throughout the year, really, mm -hmm. take in the flowers, the trees, all that good stuff. You say when you go inside, though, there's a way to sort of protect the earth even if, as we're exercising indoors. Absolutely. So we do some of these exercises, maybe put the machines aside for a second. Yeah, put them aside, just work on yourself, find what works for you, and then find something that you can add into a routine, keep doing it, and you'll get better at it. Okay, how important are weights? Weights are... They're important for what you want. It depends on what you want to do, mm -hmm. truthfully. So if the goal is to get stronger, you need to apply more stress to the muscles so that it can get a little bit stronger to recruit more muscle fiber in there. But if the goal is just to be more functional and just have a be better life, things aren't hurting as much, mm. you don't have to have weights at all. Okay. Okay. Good yeah. to know. Yeah. All right. I'm not going to stress myself out over that. Right. If folks want to check out Planet Fitness, learn more about these workouts. Absolutely. There's the website right there. Yeah. Got your Instagram, your Twitter, your Facebook, all that good stuff. Give me one tip before we go. Um, real quick, uh, just make sure like on a squat, that's my favorite leg exercise, the best full body thing or leg thing to do is just bringing the hips back first. Hips a lot of people want to come here first. Okay. Hips back hips first. Hips back first. Yeah. Got it, Joshua. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it. Kristen, sending it over to you. Whew, I'm just exhausted with that workout that I just did while you guys were doing all that. <laughs> Me too. That was really, man, that burpee though.